we all want to prove ourselves so much that what a lot of people don't realize is that if you do what you do and you love what you do, your passion will sometimes make up for certain things that you may lack technically in starting out. But then your passion and your drive will push you to the next level because you're always wanting to be that much better. Uh, the makeup and the hair and just the different costumes. I love different looks anyway, and I like to look different, so I enjoy it. But photography, the way it is, video is just the next medium, and that's where everything is going. Well, I think that because photography has been reduced from an art to a medium that is in everybody's hand. You got camera phones, they're talking about watch phones. Digital cameras are not expensive. The the camera right now, because I'm a Canon shooter, Canon Rebel, a type of a Canon Rebel, when it first came out, the lowest end digital camera, was $4,000, $10,000, some of those first digital cameras that came out, $400, a couple of hundred dollars for you to be able to get a digital photograph. And people are okay with good enough. It's good enough for me to have this. It's good enough for me to have this type of picture. It doesn't have to be great, but it's good enough and I have it and I got it right now. They'll be good enough with that for so long, but then they'll want to come back to creative art, creative photography. But in the meantime, when we started talking about video, yes, everyone can take a clip and send you a clip or something, but when you need something that's done, everyone cannot edit video. Everyone cannot create animation, video animation, animated logo. So I see the medium moving and it has moved where photography and video has actually fused together. You look at a lot of different slideshows that we do include stills as well as video. Some of the video cameras are getting even better where they can do better stills than what they used to back in the day. So videographers are not coming back to photographers for still shots. But in the end, there's still certain things that as a creative photographer, as an artist, that we can do that the consumer can't do.